This is my Schecter Telecaster guitar. I bought it in 1983, so as of 2024, it's 41 years old. Not as old as me, though. I'm 61. My Schecter started life as a brown stained guitar, so naturally, I decided to make it blue. And green. Kind of a blue green. It was assembled by someone else using various parts ordered from Schecter Guitar Research at some point before I ever laid eyes on it in a Langford music shop. As I recall, I paid 500 Canadian dollars for it. I had no idea what I was buying, but it looked like the kind of guitar Joe Strummer played, so that was good enough for me. Unlike typical Telecasters, it has two humbucking pickups. They are Schecter Super Rock humbuckers. And in case you're wondering, yes, they're super, and yes, they rock. As you can see, my Schecter is not a pointy guitar. I don't like pointy guitars. I cracked the headstock once, I can't remember how, but local guitar tech John Mears thankfully fixed it for me. As well, one time in a brief fit of rage, I don't remember why, I hit it four times with a small blunt object. It was my main guitar in my time with No Means No, live and in the studio. And also, I used it a lot for Hissanol, Two Pinned In, and my solo recordings. For years, the wiring was really dodgy, yet it worked for the most part. But a while back, I did a little restoration work on it, and now it looks and sounds much nicer than it did. If my house ever caught on fire, and let's hope it doesn't, shall we? And I could only grab one object to take with me. It might well be my Schecter. Who am I kidding? Of course it would be my Schecter. My Schecter Telecaster looks great, plays great, sounds great, and I love it. <laughs>